I've been recommended quite a few anime in my time here on YouTube, but I must say this takes the cake by far when it comes to recommendations. So many people wanted me to react to this and I am just as excited as you guys are. What's up Dapper Squad, it's your boy Darius starting a new show, Jujutsu Kaisen, super excited for this. It's gonna be replacing Don Machi. I did announce this a few weeks back on my Twitter that when I finished Don Machi, I would jump into Jujutsu Kaisen because I wanted to watch it so bad personally because I've been hearing not only so many people online in terms of fans, subs, content creators, uh, friends in real life telling me to watch this. The, the hype for this show has only been matched by Attack on Titan and Attack on Titan is one of the best anime of all time in my opinion. Opinion. So I'm not going to say jump into immediately that this is going to be as good and or one of the best anime of all time, but I know it's going to be amazing and I know I'm going to be in for a treat. So I am ready for it. Now, if some of you guys are new and do not know, with the first and last episode of every season of every show or anime we watch, the full length, which is normally only available on Patreon, is available to you guys for free. So if you guys want to click that link in the description, check that out, get a little tease as to what it's like for the future. Um, come back here for the review when you're done. I would definitely appreciate that. And if you guys like that format and want to consider keeping that for the future, consider going to check out that Patreon. We have early access, full length, other other benefits as well for this show, all the other shows I'm watching, like Q, Black Clover, and who knows what other shows are to come in the future so really just go check that out and don't forget to follow me on all my social medias instagram twitter and twitch at dapper darius i just say we stop wasting any more time i apologize for that kind of long intro let's hop right on into this jujutsu kaisen episode one called ryomen sukuna now i've seen these characters plastered everywhere on twitter instagram every especially this guy gojo it's a high school. Gojo Sotaro. Senpai! Huh? Yuji. Always love grandpa characters in anime, so I get, you know. A cursed object. Stevenson screens. That's quite the instructions, okay. like there's the opening has a, a very aquatic theme. There was a sea angel I'm talking about plankton president. I love the aquatic theme. There's a grade two curse. What the? Who could have moved it? Special grade curse object. I'm so curious as well. Man, coach is yoked. Ooh, 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 what's going on? <laughs> he puts on the burners. Ooh, it's always something crazy if it's about the parents. I love stubborn, strict grandpa characters in anime. Yeah, you know deep down they have a heart of gold. They really do. <laughs> oh, Lord. Hell yeah. 
couldn't believe the rest of the country. Great words of wisdom right there. You can tell it has a life full of regrets, possibly. Hmm. There's no way, man. He went, those were his last words. He really did go out in style. That sucks. R.I.P. to Gramps. I only knew him for like five minutes, but you could tell he was a real one. He came looking for him because of the curse. Ushiguro. Okay. Really? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I don't like this right now. Oh, no. See, but this is where Grandpa's words are going to come into play. You know, we got to save everyone we can, especially those closest for us. Oh, no. Oh. Yeah, if there's ever going to be a cursed object, that seems like that could be it. Oh, no. Oh, no. Nah, it's a wrap. Ooh, I love super creepy. Oh my god, this is horrifying. I love super creepy anime designs like this. Ooh, jumping right into it. Ooh, demon dogs. Oh, I can already tell you this is gonna be so amazing. Little white and black yin yang summoning jutsu. Ooh. Ooh, I love the animation. Mappa is killing the game. I don't even know how he. Oh my god. This man. This death is wrong. I would agree. That is how it's different than Gramps. Yeah, me either. While he was distracted by Itadori, then he got him. シキガミ。呪いってのは普通見えねえんだよ。死に際とかこういう特殊な場では絶対だな。あ。だったら、せめて自分が知ってる人くらいは正しく死んでほしいって思うんだ。アンダーステンダブル。自分でもよくわからん
Is he gonna eat it to gain curse? One in a million? He's our main character. I'm sure it's gonna be one in a million. That oh oh my Oh, I love the camera switching sides to show the personalities. He's shocked that he's able to suppress him. Oh, is this why he's going to be executed? That's why he got captured and we got the beginning of the, like... There's no ending on this episode too, man. I can't wait to see the outro. I've heard that's also a banger. All right, I won't lie. Absolutely love this first episode. I got so many different vibes of so many different pieces of media that I've watched throughout the years. And I don't want to compare this show to all of them, but it only is like the best parts and the greatest parts of them. So like, I can't like be mad at that. I love that actually. Like, and, and what I'm saying, like the whole curse aspect where it's, it's a very special type of people who are born with this gift or can somehow get access to this gift where they can see these curses and and possibly i'm guessing jujutsu high is going to be a high school with exorcism based focus and like teaches people how to get better at exercising curses and that's maybe it's like a secret police or a secret you know special force that helps people with this really reminds me of mob psycho 100 you know it's definitely a lot played a lot more funny and a lot more for laughs than mob psycho but it's also very serious at times and very similar to this where you know gotta help people out there's people who unknowingly get themselves in dangerous situations and i love that aspect because you can do crazy monster designs like i think these are going to be on par with mob psycho and or better from what I've seen so far, and I absolutely love the animation and design in Mob Psycho 100. One of my favorites. Another thing I got uh, I got reminded of at the very end of this episode was Full Metal Alchemist. Um, no spoilers for, I mean, it, it's a somewhat of a spoiler. You guys have all seen, you guys have definitely seen these anime, come on. But um, with Greed and, oh, I forget his name, Ling? What is his name with uh, when he would when his body was like, you know, taken over and then they would have little internal battles and there was such great character development on both sides and there were similar interests and then they would, they would clash at certain points. It can just lead to great character development and we can get to know our enemy or antagonist because he's forced to share a body with our protagonist. So it can, it can lead to some interesting stories. And then I also thought of like Nen from Hunter Hunter with you in order to exercise curses, you need to use curses of your own. But in order to I'm, I'm sure everyone has their own individual set style swag, whatever that may be. But for Fushiguro, his is the Shikigami. I got to write that down, actually, which I love the yin and yang. If you guys heard that, that was another video rendering of mine. I'm editing. But I love the yin and yang aspect of it. I love how wild and how strong they are and they're, they're down to eat the curses. That's like that's their way of exercising them. But he has to retain not only consciousness, but like focus and concentration in order to keep them. And he has to like it's, it's, it's not just something it's not like Naruto where you can summon them. And if they take damage or if they you know need to send, you can just get rid of them like you don't really have to be. But like he needs to be able to it's it's I, I, I like that aspect. I really do because mm, I really do. I just really do but overall fantastic episode. I love the grandpa and the troublesome curse that he laid on Yuji. Um, I'm, I'm assuming their last name is Itadori. That's why they're both called that, but you know, everyone else calls him Itadori, but his grandpa called him Yuji, his first name. Um, he, he knows his grandpa had a proper death, like the way, I don't want to say you're supposed to go, but he, he lived to be an old age. He went out peacefully, he went out in style, like he said, but he knows his friends dying to these curses is not a proper death, so he's gonna do everything he can in order to prevent that. Um, 
I just really like his grandpa so far. He was gonna say something about his parents. I know his parents are gonna play a role. Oh, I, uh, this is gonna be insane. I know it is. I can already tell the show is gonna be kick ass. I'm very excited though, very excited. If you guys enjoyed, please leave a like. Let me know your thoughts down below. Like always, yo, check out Early Access, full length over on that Patreon. I appreciate y'all. I'll catch you guys later. Peace out, Dapper Squad. Have a great day.